Hey guys, in this video I'm going to show that empty set is a subset of any set A. So let's start with the definition of empty set. And when I'm going to write definition of empty set, I'm going to use my set A. So definition of empty set are the elements x such that x belongs to A and and oh, uh, x doesn't belong to A. And you know, empty set it's a set in which doesn't contain which doesn't contain any elements. And you can see this is actual definition of empty set. Why? Because there is no such element x. If there is one, it means x belongs to A and x doesn't belong to A. But it's a puzzle. Why? Because set element cannot the same type be inside set and outside of set. Yeah, so this is the definition of empty set. Uh, the next fact that we're going to need in this problem, uh, we're going to need that if B is subset of A, uh, what, is it, uh, what does it mean in terms of logic, this expression? In terms of logic, it's equivalent to, I'm going to take the any element from uh, set B, and from here we'll get that this element X belongs to set A. And I'm going to use this expression to prove that empty set is subset of A. How I'm going to use this one? Uh, before I'm going to use this one, I need to recover what does mean the difference of two sets. And the difference of two sets, for example, A and C, uh, you can say there is such element X, such that X belong, uh, belongs to A, and X doesn't belong to C. So if we're going to draw uh, a Venn diagram, and you can see this is your C and this is A. And what, what do you mean like? This is element that belongs to C. This element belongs to A. So A minus C are such elements that X belongs to A and X doesn't belong to C. So this is going to be your A minus C. This is our A minus C. And let's take instead of C our subset B of A. So I'm going to consider A minus B. And what does it mean? It means I had my set A. I took some elements, some elements, subtract some elements of subset of B. And I'm going to get this remainder of set A. So this remainder is my A minus B. And what do you know a bit about A minus B? A minus B is a subset of A. So if I will take any subset B of A, subtract for A, I will get subset of A. But let's take B to be A. When I'm going to take B equals to A, I will get that A minus A is a subset of A. And what is A minus A? According to this definition, a minus A are such element X that X belongs to A and X doesn't belong to A. And if you're going to take a look at this expression, it's exactly the definition of empty set. So A minus A is empty set. So from here, I will get that uh, a minus A, or in other words, an empty set, is a subset of A. And proof is done. The only thing to show why this is true, but this is strictly a logic implication. Why? Because I know if X belongs to the left-hand side, then X belongs to A. But X belongs to A, so X belongs to the right-hand side. Yeah, so yeah. Thank you.